we're a very medicated society and people are taking drugs that kill them. I mean, you watch any drug commercial, the side effects is almost comedy. If I take that drug, I have these 47 side, so that, that, those drugs can't be good for you. So you go, what, what is an alternative therapy? And that's where the plant comes in. Humboldt's a cannabis-based health and wellness company that's designing products that provide a repeatable and consistent experience around cannabis that's designed to make cannabis-based therapy accessible to all. Providing an opportunity for patients to have a consistent dose each and every time led to the design and invention of the dose pen, which is a dosed vaporizer that delivers a precise two and a quarter milligram dose each and every time. No matter how hard the person is drawing on the pen, it shuts off after three seconds. It has a heptic feedback loop in it so that the pen vibrates uh, once the dose has been achieved. And even if the patient continues uh, to draw on that pen after the vibration happens, no vapor is inhaled. The product is everything for us. Sourcing material is incredibly important and those relationships are incredibly important. Cannabis and the cannabis industry has a sort of a dark cloud over it. By many people, it's considered a very dangerous drug. And when you do the research and you, you look into the science, it's actually far from any of that. We think about our customer base as patients. We think about you know cannabis and, and Humboldt's design to play a therapeutic role in people's lives. I think with inside the cannabis space, there's been this conversation about the difference between medical and recreational. That label of medicine, it's a legal structure and it's the government mandating that qualifier. I think people and medicine as a whole and politics and culture are starting to see that the plant can be a really beneficial tool. We really looked at, throughout time and geography, how cultures and people and humans use cannabis and what they used it for. You begin to see that cannabis was used to help make humans more successful. Treating pain, sleep, and insomnia, anxiety, or what we might now know as like modern day PTSD, a whole host of quality of life issues. Our approach has just been to treat this like plant-based medicine. That's what it is. It's a tool for health and wellness, and so we've really leaned into, A, first and foremost, how do we bypass the stigma that's surrounding cannabis? How do you avoid the cues that culture has developed as a result of you know, the federal government's relationship with the plant and its role in society and Western society? And lean back to the truths around it, which are, it can help you, it's non-toxic, that can play a really important role in your lives and, and focusing on helping people look at it through that lens.